Hello there. According to a few people, all of my recent videos have been terrible, so I thought today I would take it a step lower and do an unboxing video. This is another eBay package deal. This whole entire thing cost me about 20 euro plus shipping. So let's get the box open and see what is what. And if you've been around on YouTube for long enough to remember the unboxing video craze of a few years ago, where YouTube was just full of videos where people were opening boxes, make a comment and tell me. So, got a bunch of packing material. And, wow, they did quite a nice job packing this all up. Lots of damping material, which is good because uh, the shipping service that they used is not the best. So, here is a camera bag labeled Panasonic. Let's take a look inside and see what's inside the Panasonic bag. Ooh, yes. Well. Actually, you have, not, you have not seen what this is yet, so I shall just put that there and uh, we'll take a look at it in a few minutes because this contains the item that I got this whole entire package deal for. So let's continue with the next bag. This is also labeled Panasonic. Let's take a look inside this one. This is, uh, well, this is dirty. Doesn't look like it's mold, so should be safe. And here we have, wow, this, this is tiny. This is a mini DV camcorder and this is really small. So that's a Panasonic mini, oh dear, Panasonic mini DV camcorder, but there is a problem right there. Um, something just fell off. It's, uh, it's this thing. Um, let's see. It almost seems like this would just somehow clip in place. Well, maybe not. Anyway, so that is a Panasonic Mini DV camcorder with something that fell off. Next, we have this, which is just in some uh, foam and bubble wrap. And this is a rather bizarre looking ancient Olympus camera. What sort of a battery does this take? Oh, it takes four AA batteries, so what sort of memory card does it take? It takes, oh, it takes compact flash. So I can actually try this out. So that is next one. Next thing is this leather camera case, this, uh, well, I guess it, this was quite nice when it was new, but well, it feels a bit odd now. And this contains, well, this contains, first of all, one battery and two batteries that both belong to this one. And then it contains a really small little Sony Cybershot point-and-shoot camera. This is uh, DSC W35. This is uh, looking a bit sad. Three times optical zoom, 7.2 megapixels. And this takes... Oh, well, it does come with a battery, so there is that. 
and it even comes with an 8 gigabyte Memory Stick Pro Dual. So that's good. What else do we have? Well, we got this camera bag, which I shall put right there. And then we have this. This should be the final item. This is, uh, this is also kind of dirty. This is, actually, this is kind of nasty if you touch it. Let's see what's inside. You. It's a Nitec ND4000 digital still camera. So it, it is a digital camera. Yep, it does have the display. I wasn't sure because uh, on the eBay advert, this big bulky thing looked like it could also be an old 35 millimeter film point and shoot camera. So this one, let's see, this one, oh, okay, this one also takes four AA batteries and it takes an SD card. Does it list any other specifications? Four megapixels. Okay. So there is the Nitec. And this thing, this is, let's see. Oh yeah, this, uh, I'm going to keep this in the box because this is, uh, you might be able to see this thing is crumbling. Is there anything else in here? Oh, we do have an Olympus instruction manual. Now, the question is, it says Olympus XA. Does that belong to this uh, crazy looking camera? <laughs> no, it doesn't. It belongs to an old 35 millimeter film camera. As you can see, that's how you insert the film. So, don't need that. And that's it for this box. So now, let's take a look at what's in here. And as I told you, this is what I uh, got this whole package deal for, and so I really, really hope that this is going to work. Because this is a Panasonic HDC SD707 camcorder. This came out in around 2010, so it is an old model, but this was the first camcorder that had full HD 50p. So 50 progressive frames can be recorded on this camcorder if it works. But so far it is looking pretty good. I can't see any obvious signs of damage. And I do have not one but two batteries with it. And those, yep, those are both genuine Panasonic batteries. So if this camcorder works, then uh, this alone is going to be worth twice as much as I paid for this whole entire package deal. Here is a pouch in here. And in there we find a little case for an SD card, the strange little tool that Panasonic gave you to operate the touch screen, the lens hood that you can screw onto the front of the camcorder, and that's it. Nothing else in here. Given that there is an SD card case, Let's check if there is an SD card in this camcorder. Nope, there isn't.
So there you have it. That is the unboxing of uh, two camcorders and three digital still cameras. Thank you for watching.